Today, I'm going to share with you my sinking funds cash stuffings as well as give you an end of the month update. Let's go. Hi, beautiful people. Thank you for tuning into my channel. My name is Keisha, aka Keisha Budgets. I'm a single mom with two little girls just trying to maneuver through this world. And I like helping other single moms like me with budgeting and finance. And I do this by way of cash up a little stuffings, uh, savings challenges, and crushing that debt, sharing my debt snowball update. So if you find value in this type of content, please hit subscribe. What's up, y'all? I hope y'all having a good day. Hope y'all had a great weekend. Well, we're going to just jump on into this cash stuffing, y'all. And it's not going to be a lot. It's only going to be about $200 because y'all, the struggle has been real this month and really the whole summer. Um, yeah, so we're gonna just jump on in and then, like I said, at the end, I'm gonna share with you my end of the month update. <laughs> That's gonna be so spectacular, <laughs> not. <laughs> but anyway, it is what it is. It's, I've had some challenges, but oh well. We, we making it through. God is able. Okay, so I'm going to try some a little different today. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm kind of hoarse. Um, allergies. But I'm going to do something. I saw another cash stuffing uh, YouTuber do. And we'll see how it works for us. Okay. So first she started off by just laying out her envelopes. So I don't know. Should I lay them out this way? I want everything to be in frame. Let's see. And by the way, if you like these envelopes, uh, please check out Jasmine at uh, Budget Treasures. Uh, that's her um, YouTube channel, as well as her Etsy page. And that's where I got these awesome scripts from because you can get the scripts on the envelopes. It's a little more expensive. Or you can just get the scripts. So I just got the scripts and I put them on my own envelope, okay? Okay, so I think I got everything in, in frame. So what we're gonna do is we're going to stuff um, like this. And I have, y'all got $200. So we're just gonna pop, 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 pop the money where I think it needs to go, okay? Now I'm not gonna lie, I'm gonna first start off with this line kit right here because I already ordered the little fella $400. And um, I keep missing him because I feel as though he's coming by and I'm not home. So I really, <laughs> I need to pay him. And then it's, it'll soon be time to get the grass cut again. So I'm going to go ahead and just put 2040 for the last time I owed him. <laughs> and then I'm going to put... Um, 40 more dollars for the next time because we're probably going to get one more good cut. One more or maybe I know at least one one more. Maybe two more. I'm not sure. So we shall see. Okay. Now let's see what else is you know what? So let me let me let me address <laughs> the sinking funds that have been totally neglected. <laughs> like car taxes, gifts, and household. I'm going to do car taxes. I'm just going to give that 10 because I just paid them in July. So I got a whole another year to save up some more money for my car taxes. So I'm just going to put 10 right there. Um, let's see. Gifts. I'm going to give gifts another 10 or a 10. Oh, I straighten out my money. Y'all can't stand some bent up money. Okay, and household, I'm going to give household a 10. Okay, so let's see what we have left. Um, let's jump on into Christmas. Um, because my goal is, I think, 880 to save for Christmas. And right now, I have 250 in that. So, y'all, once I get through this whole roof thing... Oh man, and uh, uh, then I could just focus on adding more to that because Christmas is around the corner. And what else is at the end of the month? I mean, end of the year. Christmas is around the corner. My AC service, I need to have at least half of that because that'll be coming up in December. And then the termite bond is at the end of the year. Oh God. House taxes are at the beginning of the year. 
So I, I y'all, ooh. Mm. We gotta get some things cracking. Okay, so Christmas, I'm gonna drop that 20. Let's see how taxes I do in January. So I'm gonna give that, that a 10. Let's see, AC service, I'm gonna give a 10. Um, iPhone, I think everything else is gonna probably get a 10. iPhone, let's see, car repair. And because of my warranty, I don't have to get a whole lot of things fixed on my car. But I'm gonna save money here to get it to get it washed. Okay, so let's see. We got termite bond, rainy day, and medical left. I think hey, thirty dollars. That makes it easy. Bam, bam, bam. Woo. Got everything covered. So, so that's pretty much it. So, um, yeah. So. While I'm kind of putting these in the envelopes, I'm going to talk to you all about my um, end, of the day, end of the month update. Y'all, this roof thing is just it's driving me bananas. I, I I just don't know. But you know, uh, Mr. Nate is going to come out tomorrow and get started. Because um, the first guy that I had to do it, he kind of forgot about me. Y'all, I just, I mean... He just straight forgot about me and he had the better deal for the shingles that I wanted. And I would only needed to add like a extra um, $200. But then y'all, he forgot about me. He forgot about me like a bad boyfriend. Like when he decided to think about me a month later, then he started calling and leave a message. I'm like, really? And by that time I had already secured Mr. Nate. And even though um, Mr. Nate and all the other gentlemen that I spoke with, their prices were about around the same, an extra thousand dollars I need to add um, to the insurance money that I got. Um, but um, this something about Mr. Nate, I really, really liked him. Like his spirit, he was an older, older guy. His spirit really, really set well with me. And I should have went with him when he first came out two months ago, but then I was like, well, the other guy had a better deal, but then the other guy just dropped me. So. Sometimes a better deal is not always the best thing to, thing to do. Um, it's not. It's not the best thing to do. So, so that was pretty much that with him. So Mr. Nate starts tomorrow. I had to give him half of the money yesterday. Then when they get done, I give him the other half. So, you know, it 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 it, it all is gonna work out. I, I'm not gonna worry about it. Um, but um having to save up um, a whole nother thousand dollars, you know, budgeting for that, that that was a lot. So, oh, I got 200. <laughs> I wish I was depositing 200. <laughs> 20, girl, 20. So, so that was that with the roof. So we got the roof squared away. So that should be done tomorrow. Also by the time you watch this video, it'll be tomorrow, because today is Sunday, so it should be done. It should be done and squared away, okay? So, to be honest, y'all, my debt's still ball. It, 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 it ain't, it, you know, I'm gonna be grammatically incorrect. It ain't moving. It, it ain't moving. So, it, it's not. Okay, so, so right now I'm having a debt desert, not all a, a budgeting desert, kind of, sort of. Um, but you know, I'm not gonna worry about it because I just gotta get through, get um, straight with daycare, get that straight, and then I only have one kid. Well, I only have one kid in daycare, okay, so just trying to keep up with daycare. That's just like, oh my gosh. So, so yeah. But um, but that's that. So um, with my lifestyle sinking fund, I only have two hundred seventy-six dollars. Well, let me not say I only have. Okay, so my sinking funds, I have $1,280 with this. Um, $1,280 uh, saved up. So, so I am happy about that. I am definitely happy about that. Um, 
and I get paid this week. So I'm gonna, so I'm gonna get squared away with, with daycare or whatever. So that that all is gonna be gravy. Um, so we'll be good to go with that. Okay, so let's see. Um, so my savings challenges. Um, you know, I got a good little bit uh, saved up in there, but you know, that was kind of like on the struggle bus because by now I should have way more saved up. You know, 52 week challenge, I'm definitely behind on that, but um, I'm going to do my best to get caught up. Um, but I got to get some stuff paid off. I, I, I really do. Um, yeah so i know some of you may thinking maybe thinking well take the money that you have right there on the table and pay xyz but you know I, i'm not gonna do that I, I i have a plan and it's gonna work out it's going to work out okay so um so like i said i'm i'm pretty much in that snowball desert i mean i had to put a lot of money out to pay for the roof because it it was in bad shape and but it, you know it's all good it's all gravy as they say but um i'm not gonna worry about it but i hope that you all are doing well or that you all are keeping yourself safe y'all and you know my kids in these masks um we are doing better y'all i got all my shields up so every desk has a shield. Every desk has a shield. So I'm happy about that. And we're hand sanitizing, uh, coming in, uh, going out. <laughs> we're washing our hands, cleaning the desk. I mean, trying to keep our masks on. Well, I'm keeping mine on. I'm making my kids have to stay on top of them. I mean, if I pay, say, pull up your mask one more time. Oh my gosh. If I could get a get a dime for every time I've said that, I'll be debt free. <laughs> I wouldn't have to worry about the struggle over here. I wouldn't have to worry about it. But anyway, thank you all so much and I appreciate you all hanging out with me. I love y'all. And if you have found value in this video, please hit subscribe. Um, give me a like y'all. We, we getting closer. We almost at 800. So, you know, I need 1,000 subscribers, 4,000 watch hours, and I appreciate y'all. Because, like, in the last week, I got almost, um, I would say in the last 28 days, well, let me see, no, let me think back. The last uh, few days, I've gotten, like, 40, 50 subscribers. So, I'm like, whoop, whoop. So, Keisha's moving on up. Keisha budget is moving on up. But I appreciate y'all. I love y'all. Thank y'all so much. Take care of yourselves. And remember, take care of your money, and money take care of you. See you guys in the next one. Bye.